I think since I was a kid, I've always been um, a helper, a servant, a person who cares about other people. And so it was a natural fit for me because I'm the type of person that I always liked it to help people or engage with people, see people get better. It brings a lot of satisfaction, so it's a lot of self-fulfillment for me because I feel good when other people feel good. So it's a mutual thing to help other people because I feel good. You know, I received education from UB and the School of Social Work. And the School of Social Work also, and UB taught me that you're going to always be learning. If you're not hearing them, then you're not serving them. I think as a change agent, I'm putting myself in the shoes of the people who I'm working for, as well as the agencies and institutions, but trying to find that balance. Half of my career was counseling, but then I also realized that I wasn't in the power to change policies and procedures. So for half of my career was engaging and being empathetic and case management. But then the other half I realized that I needed to go back, get my MSW. That's what helped me from an administrative standpoint, looking at policies and procedures, looking at it from a macro level, just not the clients, but looking at systems. And so I think that was important in my trajectory because it allowed me to understand, even to help the clients, you have to change how we look at some of the, you know, the policies, the procedures, and the missions, and all of that different stuff. If you want to help people and change people's life, I encourage you to be a social worker. I encourage you to help people, not for you know the title. It's just amazing to see people feel better. <laughs>